Impromptu podcast with Noogie, take one. Pog? Pog? How's your bill going? Uh, it's been good. Lads after this one. Somebody, everyone seems to really like it. Somebody told me to bully to make an update. Yeah, yes, I'm making another update. I already did an update. Oh, nice. So make sure you check Noogie's uh, YouTube out for an update. Let's make see. more updates. That's awesome. Wait right there. Dude, I have the slowest ever time to maps for me. Who put you in the bag? Already? Eight or nine hours to maps. Stay out of it. it was just because I kept spamming the lead mechanic. It's so fun. Oh, yes. I did the same. And I noticed like people were so fucking slow to maps, even first. Yeah. Crazy. But like, I don't necessarily feel like the league mechanic was super rewarding either. It was just very fun. Um, until maps, no. Yeah. It's not, no, not really. It's just like it's randomly like, alking some items. You kinda, yeah. For the, for the putting into Krangler. Yeah. I think, um, I think it could be rewarding once people figure it out. Like, you know, like you, you know exactly which one you're looking for. Yeah. Yeah, like can, I'm like, like spam it, corrupting it's like yeah but it's like one of those mechanics that needs you to oh yeah kind of like know what you're it. looking for in events it, it's a bit like synthesis yeah but it really is. one thing i don't like is that when i was listening to chris talk about it and stuff and he said he would like you would get three tries basically yeah you don't really get three tries you get one because most of the corruptions you'd ever want like i haven't seen any like tier one corruptions that are really special would really care about all tier three corruptions so you get one chance and it takes quite a while to get there right and okay so i haven't done that much crankling on items just right yet i mean i mean literally flat out yeah i saw that that's fair and yeah i think i, I think know. i don't think uh i don't think they did a great job at making you know all the mods that interesting the combinations they're very generic i feel it's like very on off it's like you do one damage type or the other or you don't do one damage type or the other and yeah. i don't know yeah it's a little and, like boring. The, the, the downsides are like pretty big and there are dead upsides okay then yeah like it's already i just think it's, it's too like generic yeah I mean, there are really cool, and th there's weight on the positives too. Like sure. that—that's like very often. Like I'm like, oh, okay, twenty fire rice, cool. Yeah. But that like doesn't really. I don't. I don't already struggle with fire rice. I'm like twenty life. That's nice. Mm -hmm. But that's not gonna like make or break a build. So, I wish there were a bit more of the like special mods and less things. Like you know, like oh, okay, reflect to enemies, like fist damage to enemies. I think that's very like i don't think those should have been there yeah it's like I, that that's the only thing i feel like it's like kind of a mouse in the sense of that that there's the um um the the weight and the dead positives and the downsides are insane and that also makes the um one of the one of the skills we can take the stabilizing energy 10 percent chance for it to be a lower tier of a downside but it's mm -hmm. like even if that was a hundred percent chance for a lower tier of a downside, I wouldn't take that instantly anyway, because with some of the downsides, it's like, are you dealing no fire damage or sixty percent less? I'm not going to use either of those items. Oh, no matter right. what. So it's, like it's same, same. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's true. That's actually very true. So yeah, I think I think they need to like revisit like the mod pool and like how they interact a bit. I think I think there's um, I, it is important to know that with this kind of stuff it's like it's it's literally like whenever you get something good it's just more stats on your item. Yeah. So yeah. it's like it's a lot of it's a lot of power creep. So I definitely get yep. Yep. I get that. So it's like it's hard to like both make it interesting without just power creeping the shit out of us. Yeah. It's hard to find a balance. And like yeah. look at some of the test ones, right? You can literally get an additional like AoE and stuff. And wait, what? You can get AoE on chest, Prodigy on chest, like AoE gem levels. Oh! Like, I looked at them, and there was just so many good stats you can get. Yeah. Curse on gloves, that's what I'm like, I'm just spam crangling gloves. Oh. 
and you have to do Whoa. it twice, right? Because you can corrupt it and then crangle it. Yes, that yeah, that's yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like it's it's really like the double whammy that you're going for. Yeah, and I was very surprised. So when I heard about the leg mechanic and I was watching all the videos and stuff, I thought they were replacing implicits. I I didn't think that you it did? was going to yeah I didn't think it was going to just add. So when I did my first oh. item, I was like, wait, this didn't replace the implicit. Yeah yeah yeah, yeah. it's crazy, it's crazy it's strong. Just an extra thing. Yeah. Like it's it's like the, the mechanic itself is absurdly strong, I hope I get but you know, it's hard to feel like you're gaining. I think I feel like especially early on until you have, until you like figure it out and you priest like, you kind of like. You need to you need to prepare items. You need to have like a strategy going into it, right? I'm gonna get these mods. I'm gonna go and then I'm gonna corrupt, hope for that, and then crangle into it and see if I can get you know some good stuff on top. Yeah. I think overall, like eventually, people will you know make some like really crazy stuff. Oh yeah, no, for sure. But I I do wish that the I think that's something that's been like the worst thing they've ever done with almost every league mechanic like this including like synthesis and other things is yeah. that the floor is so uninteresting it's either yes. like completely giga broken items that the average player is never going to see or it's 16 fire vests and the people don't get excited about 16 fire vests on their item but okay so i i want to counter that a little bit with this idea that a new league mechanic Need so yes, you need to be excited about it, but I think the gameplay can be enough for that, and then it needs to augment the game itself. If if every time we get a new league mechanic, the first thing you see has to be omega exciting, and the the way things become omega exciting is when they're very powerful. Ah, uh, like, okay. That's wait. There's a difference. There's a difference the between 16 fires and but, 20 flat added fire. Like that is very exciting. I love logic. Yes. So have it, but it's very hard to balance between like figuring out exactly what mons are powerful early on, but then lose value later on. So you don't just like. But my point here is that. I think it's a good thing that they're going away with the, or at least for for now at the start of the league, that they're not just showering us with things that are shiny. That just feel like it's their heavy impact. Because when everyone has like a bunch of chaos, I mean, it doesn't really. I mean, you can use them, I guess, but you're not like richer than anyone else. Right. Yeah. I don't know. I just. I, I, feel I like, really like it. Like, I feel like that. They've, they've garnered this like expectation of for people that My we get crazy things every time with the oh, league mechanic from the start and it has this. to like break the game and i feel like that's just so unhealthy rather than having like oh i could go do heist for some currency i can go do this for this thing the blight right where you have like these goals to do like depending on what you want and depending on what you need you'll like do the different league mechanics and the new league mechanic gives you this thing and i can engage with it you know, I can get all the Krangle stuff there, and that's really cool, but I'm not really getting the right. other stuff that I use the other mechanics for. I, I totally agree, but I don't think, uh, Survived. like, you know, like the POE community is like a fucking coke addict, right? Like, it's just been getting, like, items after items and fire creep after fire creep, and then going from Expedition and Ultimatum to this. Like, you could have done, like, a, they, they could have done, like, an easier wind-off, because this is, like, kind of cold turkey on, on currency and stuff. Like, how, how many, like, I'm I don't, maybe you have a shit ton, uh, and this is a bad argument, but like, do you have a shit ton of Chaos and Scours? Because I don't. Yep. Because I ran Heist and Expedition. Yeah, I'm spamming those. I mean, I've even been I've, buying I've every, plenty. uh, Heist every time I level. Yeah. I mean, I have plenty of currency. I've had less than, like, 80 Chaos. Scours are a little scarce. Uh, I don't really mind that too much. So you don't, you don't feel like there's a problem with Chaos? No, I think there's plenty of ways to get chaos right now. It's there's so many mechanics where you can get. I think I feel like most people don't want to, you know. Go for, have you delved at all? Yeah. Okay. I mean, do you I'm, not have chaos then? No. I haven't delved the shit ton. I'm gonna do. I have eight missions I'm gonna do after heist. 
Right. Now, how much chaos do you have right now? I mean, I have 60. I have 60 orbs. I mean... What? That's plenty. What do you mean? But this I, is this is what, what I mean. Saying. Saying. It's I, like I say people... I like no, I like this. I'm saying it's very cold turkey compared to the last thing. Yes. You should wind but people I, off I, over time, not like do it like cold turkey. I don't know, but yeah, I guess. It never goes well. I, but okay, okay, follow me here. If you wind people down from the expectation, then you're okay. Happy Let's look at like what they did with like links as well. Where they just kind of like dumpstered all the link damage, like the support damage. Yeah. Right? Are you gonna do that one percent at a time each league? I mean, that's very. If the problem is already there. I mean, you don't you don't have to go all the way down to one percent, right? You could have. But I don't think they did. We we have so many good league mechanics that they've introduced over time, and they're pretty the easy to engage with this this, this league. I feel. I think it's going to be a very short. I feel like just talking to chat and stuff, most people are having like very, very no short on currency. Yes, but I get that. I... Nah, you're just drunk, so there is the, like there, okay. So I think that there is an inherent problem in that the, they keep, like the league mechanic has been a band-aid for their item system for a long time. And it, it's both in regards to like crafting and rares and currency. There's not a good balance in just, let's say that you, let's say you're just going to standard right now, right? You wouldn't have uh, the league mechanic, but you would have everything else normal. And then the base game doesn't really provide you with enough. You see what, you see the problem there? That, that you kind of need to augment the base game without the mechanic, like, even if you if you don't have an engaged with like heist or anything yet. Right. So there is. I mean, there's... I I think like if I was going to change anything, I would do like base currency rates up by like twenty percent or something for like yeah natural mapping. I yes. A, a, a lot of time. And I think that's the thing that I think that's a much more. Uh, that's a much better approach. Just give us like general currency, more of that. And then you can augment it through the league mechanics if you need even more, rather well, than. Well, I I I've never mechanic. really I've never really liked. The, I, I I agree with that. It's been a band-aid. I've never liked the league mechanic giving currency at all. I'd, yeah. I'd rather there was like. I don't but know. that's what. Yeah. I. Like, that's my I'm favorite thing is always when the league mechanic has its own like unique shit, which which I yes. love about Scourge. That's why I love Scourge. Mm-hmm. I think it's so cool. It's so fun. And like the entire way. I think, I think we never very much agree here, sis. I'll do the rest. I think we just agree. And I think we agree that there isn't like an underlying problem of like other other stuff that's not inherently leak mechanic just doesn't always give enough. Yeah. The cross like I would, if it was up to me, I think I would probably lower the power of some meta mods. Pretty quiet, I um, so. And I would increase yeah. like, you know, I would what? totally increase Exalt Rocks. Yeah, a ton. I haven't had and one yet. Yeah, I was very unlucky, um, but still. Same, same thing with like uh, influenced item and such. Like I would increase the amount of influenced exalts, and I would like maybe make influenced items a lot scarcer. But them having them roll with like, you know, better chances of getting some special mods like their mods or like having awakener and stuff. You know, have like the powerful ones, and then you can start lower in the. I yeah. don't know. Like, there's like a lot of things you can do where you just you make them more, like. I think the drops are just not special enough in Poe right now. Yeah, I think it's. No, also I agree. Like, like I just, especially are... after coming up from playing D two and stuff, like just uh -huh. items aren't really as exciting. Yeah. And oh my god, the fucking scoured items from the league mechanic is actually just awful. The scoured? Oh, the scourge items, uh, the the rare ones. Actually awful. Can I can I can I like just give you my take on that? Sure. So I think the problem. Are you? So I think one of the problems is that, and it's like it emphasizes this problem for a lot of people. People use filter blade. Now what happens with filter blade every league? New league mechanic comes into the game, it gets new shiny drop effect. So it like pops up big, it shows on the map and all that. So you are supposed to look at all of them. Now, what they really are, they are just rare items that drop exclusively out of the, that, you know. They're, they're no better than a normal rare item, but you don't show all normal rare items. But you get to see all these scourge items with like crangle effect, right? And it's like, since the normal rares 
are already it's so rare to get something Easy. good once you hit like a little bit later stage that you're not crafting yourself or something so you, it's like a double whammy in terms of like being reminded how bad the current loop system is plus oh. it's so and the randomness of the scourge combined with the randomness of the loot system just doesn't mesh well as an extra drop because it's so impossible to find something good but, but I, I still disagree so like they're just they're not the same as rare they're inherently worse because they're already corrupted right sure so, so even it worse. would make a little bit more sense if the league mechanic was fairly regularly dropping you i can't actually remember what the cursed chaos orb does but does it reroll the explicit and keep the implicit this one may have the cursed chaos orb well, what's the new chaos orb deal it just allows you to roll does it uh, reroll the scourer implicit or does it reroll the explicit? It's like a normal chaos. Normal chaos. It's reroll it or remove all mods. Yeah. So yeah. if I drop more of those, and then I would be like, I would be keeping a lookout for some cool implicits and then rerolling that for a decent item. That would have been cool. But it just right. made me instantly want to remove everything from my filter. Yeah, 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 yeah. That was like pretty bad in my opinion. Yeah. I think I think there's like two big big problems there, which is the the rares in general, and and not a very not a very um, exciting, you know, selection of mods on enough. like generic scourge items, you know, they yeah. haven't been juiced up. Like yeah. the combos are just not very appealing, and rares in general are not appealing. So it's like you put them together, and then you make them shiny from the loot filter, and people feel really bad about it. Yep. I definitely Yeah, I think that's I, that's it. probably like what the you. new league has Farewell. done worse for me. It's like those drops because I I don't even look. I ba I barely bother hovering over to see what it is. Every now and then I'll do it, but it's like I just know that it's gonna be a crankled piece of crap. Yeah. So I just don't bother. The quiet before a job gives me goosebumps. Yeah, no, I, I agree. I was very disappointed with that. So, though, yeah. I wonder what they're going to change. And, like, I wonder if they're going to change things a lot. I feel like that sh those should not even have dropped. So, let me... Which ones? The rare spirit items? Yeah. I, I, think the, I think it's a mistake having those naturally drop like that. Yeah. Um... I think the I, bosses, actually, the way they drop with like, they, cause they drop like the super juice stuff and it's super random and on uniques and stuff. And I think that's really cool. Uh, okay. So with the current way, the fact that, okay. So the, the, the bosses, they drop a unique item. Yeah. And, uh, it seems completely random. Like I've only had shit unique so far. <laughs> I think with the current way they drops, they should have dropped with only upsides, I think that should be the special thing. Well, so that if go. you... Right, get... so randomize the drop that you get, but only give upsides Ooh. for... Yeah, then it's like really fucking exciting to get a boss. Yeah. And that could be like the only way to get only upsides. Because mm -hmm. there are dead upsides too, like fucking reflect and shit. Yeah, It would sure. be really, really exciting. Like, it would, yeah, it would be so exciting. Mm-hmm. And it's pretty hard to like target, so it's not like super game breaking either. I believe in traveling light. Yeah, yeah, I could see that. Like, you have no way of forcing a boss. Mm -hmm. And I mean, if you want, if you want it on a rare item, right? It still stands that you know rare items are rare, so it's probably not you probably it's probably not gonna drop you that rare item you want with the stuff on it, anyways. Yeah. So most of the time, you're gonna get like a common unique with good mods. Or you can get really lucky and get an oncoming unique with good mods. Yeah. No, I, th I think I think you're right on that. That it, that would be better. Like strip it of a lot of its downside when it's dropped randomly when you are not in control. Yeah. Oh, let's see. I think I have one I can show that I just got from one of the bosses. Uh huh. Let's see. Scar. Yeah, a few. I dropped a little mana storm. I dropped a uh -huh. hoop with minus maximum endurance charge, minus thirty lightning. <laughs> Then fist attack damage leads his life and 30% avoid chill and freeze. Right. Um, and then also another thing that could have been cool, they could have had like wild implicit on the boss as well. Um, and then I dropped a Paranus yeah. Signet, which is minus 30 fire res, minus 30 cold, and then a fist attack leech and chance to avoid being poisoned. Ooh. So I don't know. I, yeah. I think... 
they would just be like very yeah. interesting chase items if and, and that's the thing they should experiment with things like slightly powerful for the league mechanic I oh think. yeah no they should they should as long as they they need to be very careful with whatever they introduce core to the game like obviously i'm not a big yeah. fan of expedition growing core in its current state um but like and and even like i think i still think like the community would have reacted fine with harvest if harvest was completely removed and never came back after harvest yeah possibly possibly like leading people on again like more like you know Mm -hmm. You have it, but not quite. Or it's a little <laughs> bit more. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I get that. Yeah. Yeah, that was a weird one. <coughs> oh, and oh my god. The amount of damage the League Mechanic does when you first get to maps compared to the campaign. Yeah, it's pretty... That was a rude awakening. <laughs> Crazy. Yeah, that was a very scary mechanic. Like, um... I didn't have any spell suppression because I would later like they, normally right not that many things do spell damage. It's like yeah. spark mages and like three other things right and then bosses. Uh -huh. So I was like, oh yeah, I'll take spell suppression around like level eighty eight to ninety. Mm -hmm. As soon as I got to maps, I was like, yeah, taking spell suppression now. <laughs> like almost insta died the first three maps, like the fucking Damn. angel beam and stuff like that. Yeah. Are you using spell suppression? I can't remember. Oh yeah. I kind of feel like it's bugged. Why? I feel immortal. It is. It's 50% less damage. It's insane. 55% less damage. Well, if you get, yeah, okay, sure. It's so good. I have 53. Yeah, it's so good. And then I have like, no, all the like, other stuff. It's insane. It's like, imagine having 50% fortify for spells all the yeah. time. I have fortify too, it's great. Yeah. So, uh, degen's just scary. Mm -hmm. Also, it takes I mean, it, it, a very it pretty, long time to funny. strangle items. What? Takes yeah. A very long time. Yeah, it does. Something I really did I like a little bit too long was that you can um, you can absorb corruption on an item and take it back out, and it keeps the co corrupted absorb thing. So like oh. you can like you know spend a day absorbing a or like prepping something you are going to craft. Yeah. ahead of time and then craft oh. it and then put it back in like, that was so nice and oh, that's you can go straight that's to actually... the third level like it's not like a gem where if you stop it at level 19. wait oh you wait hold on wait what yeah i figured not, not everyone noticed that so like if you have a corrupted item in right yeah like for example now i've already hit a uh, scour tier 2 but it says seventy nine thousand out of 72 so it's actively um getting for the next tier already oh well, you can it's like it's as if like you hit level 19 gem and it starts getting gem xp for if you maybe can't instantly level it but so like the opposite of the way gems work the xp oh, so overflow it's going like behind yeah that's, it overflows okay it's really oh, good oh that's kind of cool that's great so um, like i i've been just when, whenever i don't oh, have so you something can, you can like forget it in there and you're like oh i can just go 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 yeah oh cool nice and same with maps, right? I would put in white maps and people would be like, you have to craft them, you have to craft them. Well, I'll, I'll craft them later. Um, oh. Oh. Like you have I to like do that. it before clicking the transform button. Yeah, 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 I get that. So but... nice. Oh, that is really nice. Yeah. Also I'm with corrupting maps, gain... it seems like you instantly know if it's good, which is weird. Light. Like on the first one. Like for example, I tried I had one, I went like where where the first reward was experience, right? Like oh. monsters get more XP. I tried exp uh, I tried upping it seven times and it just kept upgrading the XP. And now I have one with like uh, additional incubators and that's getting one more incubator each time. So I'm like, okay, you're going to ten, bro. Wait, what? Did all oh, it works like that? It seems like and that's Yo. what I'm experimenting with right now. Okay. I have a juicer map here with plus one blight oil. It's coming right back. Yeah, try to uh, try to scour it up a oh, little bit. That, that, that's going up right now. Okay. People are saying they've had lower things go on mess, but uh, or different things go on mess, but lower chance. The spirit is spent. Huh. This seems very high at least. So it always keeps the like the base. 
or what? Uh, like base boot stuff? It seems like, like yeah. Seems like it. Have you fought wow. many of the uh, bosses yet? I fought like four or five. They're pretty fun. Yeah. I was like, so... not getting. I was not ready to get sucked in. <laughs> I was like, I'm lagging. I'm lagging. <laughs> yeah, it was pretty cool. I think the animations. I think they did a really good job, like aesthetically, like the demon lords and everything, and like the tentacles coming out. I don't know. If that's a prelude to what PoE 2 is going to look like and how that's going to feel with like, May the darkness I don't know, you. It, that's really cool, I think. Yeah. I feel very immersed in the world and in the monsters. I feel like the uh, there is one of the monsters that looks like um, something like, I don't know, maybe My a regards. Bioshock game or something or like some sort of monster that would like chase you. And you can't like attack it back. Like it's just permanently chasing you. Oh. Like the like the, the feel. Yeah. Let's see. I really I just really hope that they don't do like the reward pass that they normally do where they just crank chaos drops and like generic drops and other league drops up to like right. eleven. I think I really hope they just find a better way. Makes like sense. make 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 the make the leak mechanic worth it because you want to go in and engage with the leak mechanic. If you if you have to give people other things, you've failed at making an compelling league. That's what I feel. Yeah. I agree. Like that's the thing. Like just like the mechanic has been really fun for me. Yes. I'm really enjoying that. I really like clicking the thing. I think it's it's kind of it's kind of funny how D2 did the oh we could swap instances and PoE is like, ha. look at me now. Let me <laughs> tell. Let me tell. What what have you been doing with your build? Like what at what point are you basically? Uh, I am doing a eight, and I don't know just time map stuff. Trying to get to uh, guardians. So I can get the passives. Hmm. Nice. Yeah. So I'm I'm just building up all my atlas to get the um, you know, ten ways, and eight. And stuff I like don't that. have an exalted orb yet, and I really fucking hate the the like removal of the craft from prophecy. That that is like actually my least favorite thing this league. Like, how Wait, the fuck am I gonna one? get a curb lane? Craft from pro wait, excited again? Can I roll the attack mods? It's on care blade now instead of prophecy. Oh, How the yeah, fuck I got, am I, I gonna get a one. care blade? I can target farm prophecy. I can't target farm a care blade. Wait, so where where are the oh because you need it for your build? <laughs> yeah, I gotta get a fucking plus three ball. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, man. Um, yeah, how do you, how do we get unique maps? I don't know. I just feel like hope for Zana and. Like, yeah. bestiary and sadness. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I, that is funny. I really don't like it. It's just... I mean, for the for how powerful and for how easy it is to craft bows, I like it. But yeah, it's, but not it's, the, just... it's not the way to do it. They should just the, nerf the crafting method. The, but... the way they like, seem to talk about it was they were removing it from prophecy to make them easier to find. Oh. I like, guess for trade league it does. I mean, well. it is way easier to trade. Just buy the map, you have it. In trade, you could already just buy the prophecy. True. Oh yeah, random research gives unique maps. I need to do that. Oh! I need to See? Do that. Adapting already. It's perfect. Yeah. I like that. It feels more roguelike. Yeah, I'm trying to spam encroaching darkness in best area as well. Mm -hmm. I, I do like it a lot. I honestly think this might end up being my favorite league. I hope so. I feel like it has a lot of potential. Yeah, like, like there's obviously like some, some early stuff that's yeah. like very, very unorthodox, very, very not familiar. But I like that as well. I like the not familiarity. I like that I'm kind of feel like, well, okay, I actually have to go do the other pieces of content because they and that's the thing, right? That that's kind of what I always hope heist would be. Like that's that's what I like for heist 
Because it just thematically makes sense that I'm going there to like steal a bunch of shit. Yeah. You know? To craft with some like generic stuff. Yep. So. I don't think I really like the league mechanic itself. Since, since it's just, like I've just never, mm -hmm. the league for me has always been kind of like, ah, it's okay, I guess. Mm, right. I, I think I would have really, really liked Delirium if I didn't like have loads of like PC issues and crushing and shit. Yeah. A bit of the balance was kind of crazy. In Delirium. Yeah. But, I mean, you can say the same thing here. <laughs> I'm just, just having a good time. Yeah. I'm just having a good time. It's been, uh, yeah, interesting. So, with the uh, poison concussion, have you ended up changing a lot from your initial stuff, or? No. But I, um, I'm, I'm trying to like, I, I've been like figuring out like how to fit everything, right? Mm. Fitting the aura was a little bit harder than expected. Um, and fitting the accuracy is a little, little tougher. Um, other than that, it's just been good. Uh, I mean, I've, I, I'm killing, I'm doing like all the content on a five link right now. So, and I don't have a plus one gem. Yeah. Yeah. It has a lot of scaling upwards. Have you used the, like, have you gotten any, like, tainted fusings for the six things yet? I had one, and I just found two just earlier. So I've only wow. had three drop total. Wow. I've had 13. And the two uh, I dropped was from a boss. <laughs> wow. So yeah, I've only had one not from a boss. And I've done a lot of league, like, league mechanic. Yeah. Yeah, I've been spamming the lane mechanic. Kind of like what level is your league thing? Do you know? Uh, 43. Okay, you've done a bit more than me. Mine is 40. Let but me I mean, at, at three fuses at 40, that seems kind of like... Yeah, I, I've had like 13. <laughs> yeah. I thought I was getting a low amount. I've had a few mythic herbs too. I've had three I mean, they're pretty crazy, herbs. so... I've had zero kills, though. Oh, I've had one chaos? I've used it, though. One time. Um, so I'm using... So I have a 5% fist reduction neck with Whispers of Doom that I'm using it on. Mm, wow. Yeah. Because like Whispers of Doom is triple gold. So it's like, yeah. It's yeah, just fire, fire on right. this thing. Yeah, I've been looking for talismans, but I wasn't able to really find any. So sad. I still feel like they really should start using like lucky rolls and like just reducing the amount of areas and making them better. Yeah. Like, I very rarely will I find exciting items. It's so rare. It's yeah. so fun when it happens. Yep. Agreed. Agreed. I think, like, I, out of all my time in PoE, only one of the best items I've ever found has been found. Only one. Everything, every other good item has been crafted. I have found one perfect item, or, like, one really good item. Uh-huh. The tri yeah. triple tier one Valregalia. Oh wow. That is like such nine nine hundred and eighty-six ES. Yeah, but yeah. it's like it, it, it's okay for things like that to be an option to find it. It should probably not be an option to like never find that. Like realistically finding yeah. things like that is insane. Yeah. Nice to have a balance. Also, I'm now going to do Chaos Recipe. You are? I'm actually going to do Chaos Recipe for the first time in four years. No, actually, I did it once. One other league I did it too. What are you using Chaos for? Are you just it was a race it on, uh... where I needed Beyond. Um, Essences. Yeah, yeah, I'm doing the same. I guess, I guess you've been running out of them earlier because you had to get them for your bow, right? Yeah, so I've been like, like, got them after yeah, the yeah, yeah, yeah. Essence. Yes, so I haven't been doing that as much, right? I've been like buying maps and such, like, I use most of mine to like buy out all my maps. Right. But not to spam. Like now I need it. So I'm now pretty I low into, tiers I need too. To I'm in like, I haven't gotten above tier nines. Right. Yeah, I'm like almost, I'm at like 101 completion. Right. Like, I mean, for some reason playing like way more, like as if it was a gauntlet. I play like super mm. slow. I don't know why. It's the slowest I've ever played, for sure. I definitely feel like if you've been doing early league mechanic, you kind of get a very, like, you, there's a very high sense of danger all the time, even. <laughs> so it's like, it's like, yeah. it's kind of like gauntlet tier danger yeah, yeah, if you're doing high scary. levels in there. 
Because like the demon kind of literally is gauntlet tier. Yeah. If you juice oh, it up. Dude, that's that I'm kind of sad about is is it, I, I honestly I don't see anyone doing it in the gauntlet. <laughs> like you're not. Why would you do it? Like yeah, there's no fucking reason that? to do this mechanic in the gauntlet. Bro, and there's extra speed, so you will literally just get blown up. You will like, literally you click die. Double, like, you click V or whatever your activation it is. It is key basically is, you die. going to be a standard gauntlet. Yeah. That's true. Only thing, yeah, we could do maybe points for it somehow. Like, if you can get to 300 of the league mechanic, you get oh. a point. Someone should make a... Um, if, I, if I was to make a, what's it called? Uh, bounty. I would make a bounty where you screenshot that you have 250 stacks in the T16. Yeah. It's uh, <laughs> It's a Kek W. <laughs> Dude, I have... I have a fucking armor with 380 dex requirement. Yeah? Yeah. Funny. Never gonna be able to wear that. Yeah, that's Noogie. Noogie! Yeah, no, I don't know. I'm really looking forward to like seeing how I like this thing. Like, I'm always like, I like, I like yeah. waiting things like in a week or two because the, it's always so fucking exciting, right? Even like, I, I fucking didn't like Expedition at all, but the start of Expedition is still exciting. Mm, like the yeah. start of a league is always fun because everything's mm -hmm. so new and fresh. Um, but uh, and and like Incursion was. Probably my favorite first week, and then I like kind of hated Incursion. I think there was a lot of people who thought that with Incursion. I mean, I was I was in the same boat, but there was just like I just thought the there was going to be so much more depth to it. Was just so it. boring. Yeah, Direct it was so generic. Perfect. Yeah, I was expecting there to be like you know more like you know Aztec culture with like blood sacrifice and figuring yeah. out like oh how does it matter what boss I kill? Oh, it doesn't. It yep. does nothing. <laughs> like, yeah. oh, Resident Sleeper. Yeah. Um, and then I was like, oh, okay, like, what about what rooms I unlock? How does that affect? Like, is there new bosses? No, it's a fucking vacuum cleaner, no matter what I do. Yeah. Then. Very, Focusing. very sad. I, I, I do like things like that with, like, depth in that way. Yeah. And that doesn't even have to be, like, complicated depth. Yeah, no, I'm looking on that. But this is, like, I don't know, just super simple with, like, the... It, it adds so much chase to items. It's very cool. Mm-hmm. I like it a lot. I'm like, yeah. Double corrupting items this day is going to be like... I wasn't expecting that we would have something like this until PoE 2. Because in PoE 2, I was expecting like, wow, we're going to see so many double corruptions. Because, uh -huh. you know, you don't care about the sockets anymore. So you can just... You have like 10 shafts and you just start going to town on them. But now we can already do that. Now you can see things. Oh, yeah. Fucking anything. I Are mean, I'm prepping a bunch of chests. Where I'm like going to put the Grisha's mod on there. Yeah. And, you know, some other good stats. And then I'm gonna corrupt and crangle. Yeah, my, I don't know if you've seen my current chest, but it's kind of hard to replace and I'm too scared to upgrade it one tier. Because oh, I got nice. 20 life on it. Can you show? Uh, yeah, it's Great. just 27 spell suppression, 95 life, the Grisha's craft, and 24 life oh, okay. implicit. No downside. That's cool, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So I was like. Do I really want it? Like, I I have been throwing some grades on new chests so that I, if I get another chest with spell suppression, yeah. I'll try to crangle it. You wanna, you wanna hear, hear a tip here, by the way? For like, uh, crangling? Yeah. If you're on, especially in SSF. Um, harvest five links. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I've been doing that. I've been doing that. Nice. I've saved all, yeah. all five links so far. And then every time yeah, I find I a like six fucking bow. sitting there right, right now waiting. <laughs> yeah. So what I've been doing right now. Oh, no. I did see. Fuck. No. I needed that completion. God damn it. Fuck. Right. Um, I hope I'm not dead. Apparently there's an update. I'm going to punch. Um, yeah. So what I've been doing since I don't have access to plus three bows is instead of like... On my, I do have an existing six thing short bow from the um, div card. Um, uh -huh. But what I'm doing instead is every time I find like a six socketed that type of bow, I um, will um, use a dread essence on that and then hope that it magically rolls plus three oh, or right. gets That's ready for mean. one. Because then I can easily finish the bow and six thing you whenever with yeah. those few things. 
I like that. Yeah. I really like. I feel like them nerfing the gems is one of what led them to give us easier six links. You know, like imagine if they hadn't nerfed the gems, power spike would just be too high. True. Gem I levels much are still better. big now because of that. I noticed yeah. there's a big difference getting 21. True. <coughs> I think the game is much better when, the, when there's easier access to five and six links. Like, at a, at a, like a reasonable... Yeah, I, I don't level. know. I, I think especially... Um, I think especially doing the whole um, generic six things being easy. It's good. Yeah. Five thousand. Thank you. Feels bad. Very feels bad. What are you like aiming for next? Are you doing more builds or min-maxing your current build? Uh, I mean, right now I'm gonna min-max my current build, and I'm gonna take it through. I'm gonna do basically the full middle awakening. Just sick. Uh, I'm like I'm getting all the passives, basically. Right. And setting myself up. All the scourge passives. Uh oh, I don't know about that. Right. That's gonna take that a while. That might take a while. Yeah. Yeah. Before, like, you can get everything eventually, right? And I'm like, oh, good luck with that, buddy. Yeah. I mean, that's I mean the good, okay, time. so the good thing about for standard players, at least, when you die, you don't lose XP. So you might have, so it's like, let's say that this is actually kind of, let's say that the amount of XP from from uh, from this mechanic is like around when you would have gotten 100 if you would like scourge it up all the time. Let's say it takes you that long. So if you manage to scourge this up all the time, you can say, hey, I got pseudo 100. True. You know, I got there. I collected all the XP. I might have died along the way, but had I not died, I would have gotten it. Yeah. Yeah. No, I'm like, I'm just, oh, I just hope I find one of the new cool items, like the gloves and stuff like that. I really want the gloves. Mm-hmm. So bad. But like, yeah, uh, everything counts as your kill. Oh, those? Yeah, they're very common, apparently. Oh. What oh, would that be good for? Oh, like minions or... Uh, anime Guardian. Chance Command. Doing explosions on minions. It would be insane for our Kali's Fang if you find one. Let me yeah. Tell you. Oh, true. It, like, it is loot. It's infinite. Self-proc. Many cool things. Party play. Wait, so how does it self pro? Explain. Um, what I'm normally, you have to like have something to like start it, but then since everything counts as your kill, it just keeps itself going. And normally, you would have to. Hold on. Here we are, Kali's bang. Oh, so you need to kill something to generate the spider. So when they're killing yeah, something, the trigger, they're, ah, I kill. see what you mean. So normally you right, have like, like coal to or something like that. maintain the spiders throughout the map, yeah. you would need to keep killing every now and then. But yeah. now you can just let the spiders kill for you. Yeah, now you're fine. just running with an army. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I get it. I get it. Okay. So on that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. Very cool. Oh, that's very strong. Yeah. Damn. But it's, uh, it's very cool. So many cool things. I actually found the trash to trash Wait, shield. that's like crazy for like all the unkill minion stuff. Yeah. Like there is, it's not just our that has Sadly, Null's Inclination has with this weapon. <laughs> and I don't know if it works with it. I wish somebody would test uh, it for me on fucking trade. Um, so, I don't know. It's a lot of exciting things. Oh, mm -hmm. also, you know when you go in to the lean mechanic and it stuns everything around you? Yeah. That radius should be increased. Because yes. it's not really achieving what it's supposed to. It's supposed to that you don't get one path when you go in, but the ranged units don't fucking care. Yeah. It's fine for me because I'm fucking almost unkillable in, in low tier maps, but... Yeah. I yeah, don't know. Also, like... oh my god, elementalists and stuff are struggling this thing. Like things that don't have a good way to get any sort of like spell block. Oh my god. 
Oh. Like, I posted a tweet of that, you know, that ki crying cat that just like super teared up. I was like, getting to maps with no spell prevention. I mean, everyone can use spell block, right? Like the Tempest Shield. Yeah, but I mean, it's way easier for some builds than others. Oh, sure. That's like every league, right? <laughs> sure. I mean, physical damage is struggle boss for me. Right. Only thing that can hurt me now is degens. Mm hmm Yeah. I will say though, I, I'm kind of like, I'm kind of learning the... This like, the softcore experience of... Dying? What the killed me. Because oh. it's yeah, like, yeah. when you get, it's like, it's not like a double tap or like, oh, I get like, you know, like, I recognize what it is. It's just like, my character is just gone. I'm just dead on the ground. I'm like, wait, hold on. I'm not sure what that was. And I would love hit. to know. <laughs> yeah. I'm appreciating that sentiment a little bit more now. Is there anything you do you regret going stuff for at all? No, not at all. I've had a super fun time. That's good. Yeah. One of us, someone said. <laughs> I like, the thing is, I just like to embrace whatever the game, like, whatever the thing I engage, like, do, like, I just, you know, I just embrace what it gives me. Yeah. And the play around that, I don't really worry too much about, oh, is it this or that, or... Is this the best way to play? No, it's like, if I'm playing, I'm playing with the intent to have fun and to just juice. That makes sense. I've like never interacted with a lead mechanic this much and not had mm -hmm. it kill me. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Still alive. Deathless. I mean, Fine. you've tried on numerous occasions and failed. Tried to die? Like, in, in previous leaks mechan lead mechanics? Oh. Like, Delirium, Metamorph. It's not like you haven't tried before. Yeah. Very well this time. He said the thing it'll jinx him. I hope I don't die. So like, see with farming cluster jewels, I like didn't bother. Hmm? Didn't What's bother farming cluster jewels, sadly. Oh, I mean, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I found uh, I found a nine one. So I had one. I have a ten and a six. Do you have at least the... Okay, so do you need the... Uh, between 50 and 67? Plus the jewels? The large? Honestly, I didn't really pay attention to that part yet. Right. Okay. I probably should. Yeah, because like, I'm saving all my old ones, so I can like 5 to 1. Right. That so, because like, they, like, they, um, they go to the lowest common denominator. Or the lowest, like, yeah, yeah. item one, so... Yeah, I don't know. I mean, it's not like you can do higher ones anyway, right? It'll just be harder to roll. Hmm? It'll oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's quite significant the uh, <laughs> how much harder it is to roll. So. Yeah. Yeah, item level 50 to 67. Yeah. But it's like such a pain. At least that, it doesn't matter what level I am because it's straight from the delirium mechanic, so I get a guaranteed one at four anyway. Hmm. Well, like I had to do that while low level. I don't know, it's so annoying though to like reset the mechanic all the time. Reset, wait, what? Say that again? To just like, waypoint spam. Oh, I mean, you wait, how are you going to get it then? If you're, you can't do... You can't waypoint spam now at Why your not? level. Because uh, if you're 10 levels above the zone, it doesn't give you a delirium portal. Wait, I thought that was only the original league that did that. No, like you can't find delirium portals can't like for instance foothills. If you're 73, delirium portals cannot spawn. Oh. I de-leveled five times while I was farming. Lel. <laughs> <laughs> I need to make a new character. <laughs> I actually might make a new character. 
Yeah. Because <laughs> I need like both of mine need to be from there. Oh right. Yeah. Make a delirium juicer. Huh. <laughs> Well, Sorry. I would I would want to make like an explosion character. Well, I mean, I want to make new characters anyway, so it's not really a big yeah, deal. Yeah, yeah. I want to make right. like a really fast map farmer. Uh huh. When she won. Maybe poison concoction. Hmm. Yeah. I mean, it's or a good. slinger. Oh, I glad slinger. Yeah, I, I would I would go slinger if it was, if you want to do something through me. Like poison concoction is fast, but like occulta is definitely like so early. Early level occultist, you know, like it takes it, c it takes quite a few levels before it to come online for occultist, so it's kind of like scuffed. And the uh, concoction stuff is, from what I could see with steel, he it's a really scuffed for single target, but very good for mapping. Right. Um, Makes sense. And then for the pathfinder, I mean, we have decent movement speed, but we don't have the explosions and stuff like occultist. So it's like a more rounded build, not really a map I mean user. I was thinking, I was thinking about Scion Slinger, but mm -hmm. especially if it's just for mapping, then like, oh, the Gladiator's the explosion, that's nice. Yeah, you can also do Corrupted Fever, uh, Gladiator. Oh. I would, I would be doing both. Right, but like, just strictly Corrupted Fever. Oh, right, yeah. yeah. That's what I would do. Uh, you can do like Tornado Shot and stuff on that. I might start leveling those gems now. Um, yeah. I need to level. I guess I'll level Exsanguinate and Corrupting Fever. I found it in power, by the way. What? Yep. Wait, I need that for my build. Uh, I need, I need that for my build. Spin. No, you don't. No, what actually, as much as I do? do. <laughs> what? Yes, I do. No. Because I'm going to hit like plus one on my chest and everything. <laughs> yeah, okay, dude. What? You doubt me? Bro, yes. I'm playing standard. I get Quite everything regularly. I want. Oh, true. Playing standard players. Wait, no, it's softcore. But yeah. yes. True. Fucking softcore player. Excuse me? What? Who said that? Your excuse. Um, yeah, fuck. Maybe I'll just... Do I have lenses? I don't think I have lenses left over. Hmm. Yeah, that's a good idea, Noogie. I think I may get Glad Slinger. Yeah, I think that is a good idea. That sounds fun. Very zoomy. Yeah, very zoomy. Also, the new... Um... <sighs> but is... Is there anything that would be more fun that would be more fun later? Because I an impulsive character later in late game for the endgame again? That sounds fucking fun. Uh, I don't know. Like, just like... Imagine like a really big, so like Storm's Gift and Pulsa versus the League mechanic. Mm -hmm. That just sounds fucking nice. Yeah. I think movement speed is one of the key things for the League mechanic. If you want to like juice. Yeah. So like, because like you want to, you want to basically traverse. Oh, did you know that you can see when you get a boss? Huh? Yeah. You want to know? Yeah. Okay. You know, like, there sometimes there's like the purple explodey things you run over that drop down? Oh! That's the sucky bus. That okay. means the sucky bus is in the sun. Uh, apparently, there's some yellow beam stuff or yellow uh, angel or whatever. Then the angel bus is in there. I don't remember the last one. Really? But so what? Yes! I mean, I believe Octavian. He was the one who tweeted it. Oh! That's so cool. So now you know. Yeah. So now you also know if there is... Because it's like, there. Like I remember, like the, especially the uh, the Chaos Droppy Ball, right? It's like everywhere when it's there. So I feel like it's very easy to see if you have a boss or not, whether or not you should be looking further in the map. So, yeah. Very easy to see if you have a boss. Yes. I missed so many bosses. I missed like one. Remember wow. to live. That's very exciting. Mm -hmm. Let's see, there's Crafting Fever. Now I just need Exsanguinate and I'll level those up a bit. I don't think I'm going to level them up too Hello. much. I can't get Exsanguinate well, we level. That's annoying. Oh. Yeah, that's very cool. Mm -hmm. Very 
Very, very cool. Oh, he was saying that if, like, you know, the big purple balls and stuff like that, like, you'll, you, it'll show you on the map when there's a boss button. And it'll show yes. you, you'll see, oh, like... Oh, you're saying that, yeah, I was saying that, yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah if that's that present, that. if the purple balls, like, if those blobs are around, it means that there is the, the, the sucky boss is in there, basically. Yeah. It's an indication that you're in their realm, basically. I'm just doing my completions. I really want to do. I really want to go higher maps today. I also don't have that much damage yet. Mm -hmm. I'm not using grace yet. I want levels. I want so many things, Nugi. Same. So many things. Ooh, my map is about to scare to tier three. Then I get to see if the my theory is correct. Well, wow. oh, decent chance. This is the smoothest league mechanics in Solarium. Yeah. I wonder if how people are finding it with like lore and PCs. Yeah. True. Okay, let's see. Ha, oh, it does! Three additional incubators. Yeah, that thing. Oh. Take 3000 lightning damage when you shift into an auto nightmare. Physical is fine, but lightning. What? No, lightning is fine. Physical is monka. Oh, I guess it's a. <laughs> Not for me. Physical does nothing. <laughs> It doesn't even. I don't even. I mean, three thousand is seven hundred and fifty. Uh, less than that, right? We get targeted by forty-five. Oh, true. So less than that. Yes. My point is, oh, yeah, physical don't literally worry doesn't about it. Is. But hmm. Hmm. I wonder how much more rippy they get by crangling them. I mean, a lot. How what's the highest also. crank that you've done on a map? Uh, let me see my crank. Oh, somebody in chat had tier 10 of that and it's 12,000 lightning damage on change. <laughs> okay, <laughs> dude. Wait, how much is that with just 75 res? Two and a half thousand. Oh, okay. That's still not too bad. It just sounds long. No. Yeah. Like, Ellie is not too bad. This is like a lot worse for a lot of builds. Like, if there was 10,000 yeah. fizz, I would die every time I click. Yeah, it was uh, other people have been like struggling with the fizz one, but not a big problem with this much armor. Yep. I do think that, um, I do think that, oh, actually, I think they will speed up the scouring mechanic a lot. Way too slow. The which mechanic? The scouring, like how fast the items fill up. Oh, Scourge. Yeah. I think it's too slow for most people because I'm like, I'm yeah, running at a so pretty fast pace. Yeah. And I'm thinking about how fucking much slower the average player is. They're not cutting it to scourge that many items. Yeah, no, I agree. I think the lower tier stuff, especially. I think it would make a lot more sense if the lower tier stuff, since it's not as exciting, kind of went really fast. Yeah. And you could like crank a lot a bunch of lower tier stuff. Yeah, 100%. You can make it, I mean, if they if they think it's like too powerful for like My linking and stuff, straight. I mean, you can have it so that the, uh, depending on how many sockets on an item, you just will yet. just have it go faster or slower, you yeah. know? If that's like a concern that they have, there's like ways to deal with that. Oh. How was the, uh, how was your campaign damage, by the way? Great. Was it like insane or like normal? Campaign damage? Like, oh, it was really good. Did you notice like x 6 2 Kohama totems? Yeah, they're a little annoying. <laughs> they have the eighty percent damage reduction. I was like, oh. Oh, that's why. I was like, did I like unsocket something in town by accident? Am I on a one link? I ran out of mana, and then I was like, what the actual fuck? People are like spamming like nice Quinn build, and I was like, hey. Okay, that makes sense now. Yeah. Okay. I think. Yeah. yeah that was because I remember they were a little slow. They weren't like very slow, but they were a little slow. Everything else was just melting. They were very slow for me. Because that's like pretty early into the TR swap. Yeah, and it's like, those, they're so like... small as well, so it's very hard to overlap them. Yeah, and I'm, I'm like so used to like, you know, you would shoot them once and then into the next one while it's dying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was like, oh, okay, I guess you're not going to fucking die. They got the totem buff. Well, there, change, whatever. 
seen the tipped five dollars and eighty six cents hazes thanks for all the content you make can you please repeat on which map the can't roll attack mod is now uh the can't roll attack mod thing is on careblade careblade but yeah oh that's nice we should do this every least right yeah sure I'm gonna go back to do, neglecting my stream less now. <laughs> That's what Kiss is. Have a good I'll stream, dude. Yeah, thank you. And uh, have fun on softcore. Have fun on hardcore. I will. On your white gurge maps. Hey, they're not white. Well, at 16, they will be. <laughs> <laughs> not wrong. <laughs> I don't know. I'm playing champion, Noogie. Oh, yeah, true. Don't know about that. <laughs> okay. I'll see you later. See you later, dude. That's nice. That's cozy. Did you enjoy that chat? Maybe we'll upload this to YouTube. So in case we do, enjoy the podcast impromptu and try to die less than I do.